Welcome back to the vlog. It is Friday. Uh, it's Friday. It's about half past ten in the morning. The sun is shining. It's a beautiful day. I've got the Athena with Geek Vape with a brand new build in it. And we're about to go out for the day. What am I doing? You might be asking. What am I going to be doing today? Well, stick around and you will see. I'm going to keep it all a surprise today. Not telling you what's going on. But I am going to be going out of the house into the bright sunshine for the full day. Not going to be in the house very much today. Uh, I am loading myself up. I've got the Geek Vape Athena here with a brand new build in it, and I've got the drip box here. And I'm taking additional 18650s fully charged, so I'm all good to go. Heading out the door right now. Next thing you will see is when our guest for today comes on, because I'm not going to be alone. It is a guest day, so let's get going. What's up, dads? So we are here at the train station, uh, waiting on the train, and we are going, where are we going? Glasgow. We're going to Glasgow. So we're going to go check out some vape shops, we're going to go uh, check out some Glasgow, enjoy the weather, and have some beer. So we'll check back in as we are going, but this is it for the minute, and right. maybe see you back on the train. Maybe see you on the train. <laughs> Does that work? Kinda, yeah. So Graham's custard with Blue Moon. Do you want to get a bash? <laughs> I'll give it a bash. Okay, so first the uh, Orange Crush. Damn, that's good. That, that works, that really, really <laughs> works. Okay, so on your new vape. <laughs> is this my first hit on your new vape? It actually is, I think. It's my first hit on the new vape, okay. <laughs> okay, uh, so Graham's custard. It's not as good. That works really well, actually. I'm impressed by that. It's that not really quite as good as the Orange Crush, but it's pretty damn good. <laughs> so I'm still on camera, so <laughs> <laughs> that has been blooming beer beer pairing. Uh, and where are we? Uh, we are in the Weatherspoons pub, uh, whatever street we're on. <laughs> so there we go. <laughs> uh, the wind's kind of blowing that way. So we are now sitting outside Calvin Grove Art Gallery. It's taken us two and a half hours <laughs> to get here from the train it's station. A good it's only been, it's only a mile and a half, but we have stopped <laughs> at a pub, uh, three different vape shops as well, and also a music shop where we drilled over some nice guitars. They so, were good guitars. They were very nice guitars. <laughs> so we have now made it to Calvin Grove. We're gonna have a wee vape, have a wee chill. And then we're going to go in, take a wander around the museum. I'll get some footage as we take the wander around. Uh, but that's pretty much it. We're rocking out. I've got my Geek Vic Athena still going here. I've had to change the battery <laughs> once so far. I've already killed one battery. Yep. And Lewis is still rocking out on his new alien. Yep. Which it's is so great. Good. Uh, we will talk about his alien at some point, but that's not going to be now. So <laughs> here we go. We're getting ready. <laughs>
Okay, we are getting near the end of the day here. We have been to the museum. We have been to Taco Bell. Oh, that was good. Yeah, we had Taco Bell. First time in Scotland to have a Taco Bell. Uh, we went to a bait shop. I got a new mod. I'll show that when I get back to the house. And uh, this is pretty much us waiting for the train. We're going to go get the train. It's obviously quite loud out here. We are in public getting funny looks. Yep. So this is pretty much it for the minute. <laughs> uh, it will be bye from him for now because the next bit of the vlog will be when I get home. Uh, but we have had a good day all in. Yeah, it's not been bad. It's been pretty good. So that's it for the minute. Are else good? <laughs> and I'm home. And I'm exhausted. Uh, we have had a really good day out in Glasgow today, uh, Lewis and myself. Uh, we went through, we got some beers, we drank a couple of beers on the train. Uh, we then uh, went to the pub, we did a bit of a beer pairing with some juice. We went around a few vape shops, we went to a guitar shop. Uh, then we took a walk through a park, went to the Kelvin Grove Art Museum. So if you know Glasgow at all, we walked from... Uh, Glasgow's Queen Street Station all the way out to Kelvin Grove um, went around the museum a bit there's been a bit of that in the vlog there and then we walked all the way back we went to Taco Bell there is a Taco Bell in Glasgow it opened in December and I've been desperate to go I used to live in America years ago and I loved Taco Bell and I've not had it for about 15 years so I was looking forward to this big time uh, so we went to Taco Bell and had our dinner there then we were pretty much done we were knackered at that point so we made our way back to the train station got the train back and that's me just got in the house now uh but the reason i'm jumping on the vlog this is not to end the vlog at this point this is because i want to show you the mod i got uh so before i get this all built up i'm going to show you what i got so it's a av mod set or a v yeah av mod set the alien rogue set and there it is look at that that is one shiny mech that's going on there really intricate so just get that out there you can see it is just straightforward tube it's a mech mod i wanted another mech and this is a lovely little mech it's got a nice button feel to it and it's got comes with its rda as well and shiny shiny so uh, I'm going to get this built up, uh, I just want to show it before I got it built, it comes with it, some coils, got the usual stuff like that, so consider this an unboxing, but I did go through quite a few while I was in the shop there, uh, so it's Prime Vape uh, on Union Street in Glasgow that I went to, really really nice guys in there, uh, got a good bit of chat with them, we were in there easy half an hour, went there twice today because we wanted to do a few vape shops while we were in Glasgow, Went back, and that was what I went back to. They had a nice selection of mechs, and I really wanted another mech. Uh, so that's what we went and got. And big shout out to the guy behind the counter because he checked I knew my battery safety before he let me buy a mech. So that I, I really appreciate that from his standpoint. So I'm going to put a build into this. Uh, I don't know if I'm going to get to end the vlog today or if I'm going to come back and finish it in the morning. Uh, I am completely exhausted. I can barely move. We have we did walk over eight and a half miles today. Uh, that's a lot of walking for someone as unfit as me. And my feet are killing me. Uh, I can barely move my feet. I've taken my socks and my shoes off and my feet are really sore. Uh, so I'm going to chill out. I'm going to put a build into this mod. Uh, give it a shot, fire it up, give it a try, see how much I'm liking it, see if I like it at all. Could be that I totally hate it, which I doubt. But I'm going to put a build into it, it's come with some coils, so that's what I'm going to put in it. And we'll see how she runs. And uh, hopefully it's a good wee mod that I've got here. And I might do a review on it, I might not, because it is a mech, and mechs are pretty much down to how you build them. But we'll see how that goes. Uh, I did do pretty well with the... Uh, Athena today this was the mod that I was running most of the day I had to fill up the juice bottle twice and as you can see if you look in there it's nearly empty again so I've got through nearly three full bottles of juice I took three fully charged 18650s with me and I'm on the third and that's already that's starting to go now as well so I've got through three batteries and three bottles of juice in a day so I've done a lot of vaping while I've been out and about uh, didn't really use the other vapes that I took with me very much. It was very much the uh, theme that I was using today. Uh, but that's it for the minute. Uh, I'm going to come back once I've done a build. Uh, finish off the vlog then. 
Like I say, I don't think I'm going to get this edited together until tomorrow just because I'm so tired. Uh, but I did want to jump on and just uh, give an update for the day and let you know about the new mod. So I'm going to get this built up. Okay. So there we go, I've got a build in this, it is now Saturday morning, uh, last night I got the build bit put in this, I put my feet up, I've got my shoes off, got my socks off, my feet were killing me after all that walking, got my feet up, was watching a bit of YouTube, was watching Grim Green with his latest vlog and I just dozed, I put a build in this and I started vaping on it, I'm loving this new mech, this is a really good mech I've got here. lovely flavor coming off it and uh great cloud production going on there it's a standard uh tugboat style deck there with the three posts there and you get a good hit from it it's got 18650 in it and i'm loving that design look at that detail on there that looks beautiful so this is definitely going to be a go-to mech for the time being Loving that. I think I've nearly killed the battery in here. That's nearly dead, but I've got others on charge. So this is going to be my go-to mech for the rest of the day. I've also, this morning I've been a bit buildy. Uh, I've put a new build into the Pulse. So this has a new build in it. So let's have a quick look there. Got a nice dual coil, coil build I've put in there. And that's hitting pretty well. So I've got a nice new build in there, and I've put a new build into my drip box. Now I've run out of the pre-builds that you get in this, so I no longer have a pre-build in there, but I have made my own. Now this, if you remember from the review that I did on it, it has a limit on the uh, ohms it will run. It can, can't run lower than 0 0.2, so I've got a 0 0.24 in here, and this is, it's not the easiest deck to build on, so I've had to use a... Uh, 0.24 gauge on it so that I could fit the dual coil in there but I've got that up and running and it's running pretty well I've got to say so that's a pretty decent build I managed to get in that one usually it's a bit of a pain building on that so that's what I've been doing this morning is some new builds and a bit of play I've nipped out I've had to go do some errands so I've gone out to Tesco's got some shopping in got that done it is now just coming up to 11 o'clock start work at two o'clock so it's going to be a get some stuff done around the house try and get some editing of yesterday's footage and put it all together into this vlog it's going to be a pretty big vlog i think because i've got about half an hour worth of footage and that's just from the museum yesterday so this is probably going to be one of the biggest vlogs i ever do uh, or one of the biggest that i've done so far at any rate so it has spanned two days so it's not so bad when you think of it that way uh, but I am going to end the vlog here. Uh, so it's an unusual time for me to be ending a vlog. Uh, but I will combine this all. And as I said previously on a previous vlog, I'm doing the vlogs a little bit differently now. I'm not trying to do a, a vlog every day. Because a lot of it will just be me sitting on the couch talking when it's that way. There is still a bit of that going on. But with this vlog, there's quite a lot of out and about stuff. And yet last night I was just too tired to sit and go through all the footage and try and edit it together so I'm going to get it edited together uh, I do start work at two o'clock so I'll probably be doing this sort of once I get to work when I've got downtime and get it uploaded while I'm at work so it will be uh, uploaded usually sometime later this afternoon in the evening sort of time it will be uploaded and hopefully when it comes together it's not going to be a 40 minute vlog it will only be about 30 minutes so that's pretty much going to be it for the vlog going to end it there uh, all that usual good stuff uh, like comment share subscribe no comment shout out on this one but if you do want a comment shout out if you want a shout out to someone throw it in the comments I'll put them in the vlogs uh, if you've got any questions for me, throw them in the comments. I'll answer, I'll answer them in the videos. That's all well and good. That's all good stuff. Uh, follow me on the Twitter there. You can always hit me up or throw questions to me on Twitter as well. Uh, that's at one purple mongoose. I've still got that Patreon going. Go jump over. Go check it out. 
uh, as soon as that starts generating some funds coming in there will be prizes given out go check out the video on that that will show everything there so go check it out www.patreon.com slash purple mongoose go have a look and as ever with the new one here Bay Pong.